hello. Hey, plant fam. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Jacqueline. This is Crash. He's very unhappy with being in the intro. Why are you so unhappy? Say hello. Okay, you're fine. Um, if you are not new here, um, hi. Thank you for coming back. So, I'm a bit of a mess today, but I needed to clean a bit of a mess today. So, this is my utility cart that is supposed to have all of my supplies organized on it. Looks very organized, right? <laughs> so, basically, I'm just going to clean it. And I thought maybe it would be fun for you guys to hang out with me while I do that. I'm going to lower you a little bit maybe. It's a little bit of a crazy day here. I've got lots going on, but we're moving like officially in a couple of weeks. So I need to clean stuff. And that's what we're going to do. So I am not going to talk through this. I'm just going to let you guys watch. We're going to go quickly. And then, um, I don't really know. I don't know where this video is going from there. Really crash. Come on puts his booty up in the air. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to stop talking and get to cleaning this. I 100% look like I'm crying. I can't even like pretend like I'm not. Um, hi. I guess this is a moving vlog now. <laughs> I've just kind of been filming because to be honest with you, I don't know what to film right now. I'm just like really chaotic back and forth. Um, most of my stuff, I don't, I don't even know at this point and where more of my stuff is. If it's in Connecticut or if it's in New York and I'm just like, I don't know. I'm just having a hard time I it's the next day <laughs> hi by the way I'm <laughs> it's Saturday and I just finished work and I had to run a bunch of errands and one of those errands was going to my gym and canceling it and for some reason that triggered this like I was completely fine about it and then it just triggered this big emotional response in me because I don't know I don't know I don't really actually know what's making me feel this way right now but I did want to film so <laughs> here I am um it's totally normal everything is fine it's raining um yeah I just want to say hi I'm really not good with change it was really hard for me to just do that for some reason um I don't like love the gym that I found in Connecticut so that's not helpful like it'll do but it's costing me double the price and it's like half of the size well it's like half of the equipment it was the only like quiet gym that I could find that was close by and like you know convenient and whatever anyway I am just I don't know I'm having a hard time processing things right now because it's almost June and my plan was always like mid-June to be like, you know, 
out of here, not sleeping here in New York anymore and like full time in Connecticut. Obviously if I need to come back and get things, I can come back and get things like my mom's place like she's not gonna tell me that I can't come back and get my stuff if I leave certain things behind for the time being but um David is taking a trip to Tennessee for a book thing and I'm not able to go with him and that was like basically at the same time that I was planning on moving my cat so I don't want to have to do that whole introduction of his cat and my cat thing um like by myself like he'll be there for a little while but then he's leaving so I decided to bump it up to next weekend so basically this week I'm gonna be driving back and forth I have to move all the rest of my plants up there this week and um take apart my greenhouse bring up like whatever shelving i need because we still don't put the shelves up there so it's just a lot like it's a lot um to process all at one time and obviously like this is what i want to do and this is um like what's better for me and my cat right now because I'm stressed out like having to leave him he's obviously stressed out by me like constantly leaving and us not being in like a solid routine so the sooner that I can get that get to that place with him like the better that I think I'm gonna feel like the more settled I'll feel when my cat is settled into the new place do you know what I mean it's just been very hard on me as a cat mom who loves her cat more than normal people probably do, um, it's hard for, it's been hard for me to, to keep having to leave him for like nights at a time and, um, I'm ready for him to just be there and like I need to know that he's okay there. Like it's driving me crazy like the anticipation and the anxiety like not knowing if my cat is gonna feel okay there you know what I mean like I just I want to have some solid time with him there for a while where it's just getting into a new routine with another cat <sighs> pray for me fam <laughs> like seriously I need all the good vibes right now like all of them because I'm just really stressed out and like but I'm excited it's a good thing it's just I'm really bad with change like I said and this is all very weird for me I've lived here majority of my life and it's just weird like I'm ready to move on I've been more than ready for a long time to move on but um I guess when it really comes down to it it's hard so I don't know I just felt like sharing it's been a long day um, it's gonna be a long week I'm heading up tomorrow with a bunch of plants and stuff so I can show you guys some of that um, tomorrow Sunday by the way and then Monday is Memorial Day so um, yeah I'm trying to move as much stuff up there as possible I have some stuff to ship out on Tuesday so after I do that I'll be coming back down so I'm probably not gonna have anything for sale this week just because it's gonna be really hectic um, but once I'm a little bit more settled in in like a week or two I I've been propagating like crazy and hopefully things will be like nicely rooted for you guys so in case you I'd propagate that I didn't show you my shirt I wore it to work today uh, it's from Hello Fancy Plants. I always have it linked for you guys down below. So you should check it out. And um, I was going to cut this into a crop top, but I didn't have any. A lot of my clothes are up there, so I didn't really have anything um, clean to wear to work today. So I just threw this on because I wear um, a sweater and like a schmack, a schmack, a smack over it anyway. Uh, so nobody sees what I'm wearing because it's freezing in there with the air conditioning on. Anyway, um, I look like a hot mess. Yes, I went to work looking like this because I had like hardly any clients and I don't care. I just don't care right now. I'm like, I'm tired. It's raining. I'm stressed out. 
wrote that for you. Yeah, I don't, I don't have anything else to say. I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow, probably, if I have the head to, to film anything. If not, I will see you shortly thereafter. Um, I can show you, like, what plants I have left that I'm moving, if that's something you're interested in. But I'm probably not gonna be moving them all tomorrow, because then I've got to come back Tuesday, and then I'll be here. Wednesday and then I'm going back to Connecticut on Thursday with the rest of my stuff and my cat's stuff because I want to bring his stuff there first and leave it there. Um, I can talk more about this on like the David and Jack's channel if you guys want like videos on like the cats <laughs> and how their introduction is going. I can vlog about it because it's going to take a few days hopefully not more than that you to get them properly acquainted so um yeah that's gonna be fun I want to get my cat stuff there first set up a base camp for him make sure that um David's cat is staying away from Crash's stuff so that she doesn't get her scent on it it's just his and that way when he gets there he has the bedroom that has things that smell like him he'll be in there at least for the first day or two and then we'll start like swapping them out so there's like a whole process you have to go through with cats to make sure that they're like not gonna kill each other so. yeah I just felt like having a little conversation with you before I go inside and it's of course raining harder now than it was before so that's gonna be fun because my shampoo and conditioner are also at the new place and I can't do anything about this until I get there tomorrow so anyway I appreciate you fam and I will see you soon plants lots of plants <laughs> I am um, on my way to Connecticut, obviously. So, hi. It's Sunday. Not quite the morning anymore. Well, 15 more minutes of morning. It was a little bit of a hectic morning, but I just wanted to say hi. I look like a hot mess because I need to take a shower when I get there and wash my hair and all that good stuff. But just wanted to give y'all an update that we're moving a lot of plants today and then like this whole entire big black uh, tub behind me is full of plants and uh, the rest of them are gonna be coming with me in a couple of days when I do this again so um, yeah it's fun time so hopefully I can I can fit them all in the car with all the other things so the trunk is full front seat is full, back seat is full, but driving with my plants, people can see them in the window when they drive by, I wonder if they're like, hey, that's a pretty plant. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna go since I'm on the parkway, but I just wanted to say hi, and I will probably check in again with you guys tomorrow, just because today, I don't know. When I get there, I have plant metal to open, so you're gonna see that before you see this, but um, hopefully I won't look like this. I don't know, but I will either way, be seeing you soon. Okay? Okay. Hey fam! It's Monday, Memorial Day. I just got out of the shower so I'm looking a little greasy because I just put my oils on and my hair is a mess. But that's a theme apparently for this video and I wanted to just give you some updates because I um, brought a bunch of stuff with me <laughs> and I just wanted to show you what I brought and kind of like where I'm putting things so I'm gonna turn you around and show you what's going on okay so box of plants I'm sorry I did not turn the fan off it is it's a little too toasty to be doing that lots of bedroom plants but and there's more here in my utility cart um, I also have all of these in the bathroom so these were in my greenhouse I've sprayed these three times now with Captain Jack's they just got their third go so they are ready I hope I pray they are ready to go in the greenhouse so my pink princess needs a pole my Florida ghost needs a pole my anthurium I, I guess I can put this on like some sort of support because it's kind of floppy um, but it's beautiful. My jungle boogie needs to be repotted because it's like not it, the soil is fine. I'm gonna reuse the soil 
Um, I just need to like actually pot it in there and get rid of some of these leaves because they have thrip damage, but we've got new growth. So I just, I like to get rid of any old leaves just to be safe. This is my philodendron little baby Rio that I think is growing roots. Yeah. So that's good. Silver stripe. Um, dragon scale. And then this is my silver dragon. So this is all ready to go up in the greenhouse. I just have to wait for David to get home to help me with my moss poles. You guys know I like to cut the bottom off of them so that they go deeper into the pot. So I'm hoping that getting this up on a pole and into the greenhouse that she's going to stop giving me these like really weird leaves because it's starting to piss me off. They're super pink, but they're coming in like really wonky. So she's got great genetics for like pink variegation, but she's just not doing what I want her to do. So I'm hoping this leaf comes in a lot nicer. So I basically need to do the same with all of these, spray them down with Captain Jack's and then figure out where to put them. Part of the problem is that, ignore the mess, all of these shelves are pretty full for like the most part. Um, I could probably squeeze a couple onto here and move some stuff around, but my cat's going to be here in not even a week, so I can't keep anything on these two bottom shelves that he can nibble on. Um, he's not really interested in Hoyas and stuff, but we kind of just have to see how it goes. Um, a lot of things are going to be going up in the greenhouse up here. We put up some stuff. I'm going to put more things over there. It's a mess, but I mean, there's definitely room for, for more plants on this shelf. We hung up Hoyas here. I got to clear off this shelf. I just, I have a lot of rearranging to do. And then in the bedroom here, this is not staying and I can't have all these leafy hanging bits <laughs> with my cat because he'll eat every single one of them. So I'm putting a cat tree for him, his cat tree. I'm bringing in, we're going to put it in the corner here. So I kind of have to just move everything, but I wanted to show you my cabinet and we hung up some more plants here. So I'm going to have to like adjust the things, but um, this is what it's looking like so far. I'm going to put some stuff up here. I think like some of my modern botanicals propagation frames. Hi. <laughs> and, uh, cause this is a big empty wall. So, you know, we gotta do, gotta do something with it. Oh, I got new Hoyas. They're not going to stay here. I just left them here for now. So that's, that's my story. <laughs> Oh, and I can put some like up here too. So this, all of this is coming down and going to get re-cleaned and rearranged and all that good stuff. Little by little, we're figuring it out. So um, yeah, that's really it. I'm gonna spray the rest of those plants down with Captain Jack's and then hopefully soon things are gonna be back to normal back to like actual planned and scheduled content would be nice for me to back to um restocking etsy at least once a week and uh all that good stuff so i have a lot of fun things propagating for you guys nothing this week because the move is just a little bit too crazy i have some shipments going out tomorrow if you purchased from me last week those are going out tomorrow so you'll get your tracking numbers tomorrow and um yeah i think that's it so no new plants this week but the week following some of my hoyas that i started a couple weeks ago should be at least partially rooted and ready to go i like to let them get nice and fully rooted but we don't have a lot of inventory at the moment so it's better than no plants right so lightly rooted plants is better than no plants at all. I'm going to go. I appreciate you, fam. Thank you for coming on this journey with me. If you enjoy it and you want to support my channel, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. 
hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything from me and join the plant fam if you want to come hang out with us on instagram make some new friends we got a group chat going on and there are super thanks buttons and all that good stuff kind of like a super chat like we do in live streams except for you could do it on regular videos now so i appreciate you if you do want to super thanks me if you want to wait until i have a hoya that you're trying to buy i appreciate all of the support like literally all of it I cannot do this without you guys and I absolutely love doing this so I appreciate you fam and I will see you in the next one